get into how to use export how to use import now I like to save this file I want to export this file after the end of the run I like to export it is a data table export dot export I can export all the sheet or I can expose only that sheet so if I use export I give the location where I like to store so I say I'll take the path so see online class under this path I, wo I want to create a folder in that folder that folder name I want to make it as output data or I use data inside you can have an output or an input I say data is my folder under this folder I want to create the file I will say control C I now copy that path along with the path I give the file name my first xls file dot xls I am now exporting what I do for this is I run the script without any delay so that it will be faster it runs in no time I make this delay time as zero so that it runs faster even though there might be a refresh issue for viewers I run this now it in no time he executes the script so you might have noticed some scrambling of refresh but he has now already covered g4 he is into now g4 now he has finished the run right so he has finished the run he has come back I go to the last run result in last run result you can notice now the data table is set with 5 into 4 into 3 around 60 rows of data in global sheet 3 that is action sheet 3 it is set with 60 rows of data you can now see all the 60 rows of data in action 3 sheet this is how he worked is pretty fast one of the things we have used delay that is why it was going slow now you can see that all the data and this sheet is now passed over here my first xls dot xls my first dot xls file or my first xls dot xls file unfortunately I cannot open it here reason is I am not having MS office in my machine virtual machine what I now do is I want this data to be loaded in another script assume that I this is a common data generated I need this data to be loaded then I save this as data table object in under scripts I saved the file I like to import assume that that file is your common data I want to import that file into my sheet before generally if you want to import what you generally do is export the current data table external outside and then you import otherwise there is a possibility of the current data getting lost when I import the current data table is lost new data table is inserted so usually before we import data table dot export is done even though it has an empty file I give the path my export file I should know what is the file name I am using 
then i import now data table dot import import entire data table or you can import particular sheet into particular action i import now my first xls dot xls i like to import now message box hi just to see how the import is effective right now i say hi now i run under hi he will wait during that time you can notice or i'll put a breakpoint under message box i now run the script you can see now how he is doing import and export my first spelling mistake okay ensure that the file name exists so he can see now he has imported the file but also notice that action 2 and action 3 is not imported now the reason being we have only one action action 1 so global sheet is imported action sheet is imported this is an important point to remember when you are importing import can happen based on the number of sheets that is available in current qtp test number of sheet in current qtp test is only 2 so it cannot import action 2 and action 3 if i have to import those two sheets i should have an action in my current test very important point that you need to remember right so i imported now after the import my script runs for all rows the reason being because we have by default global sheet is set with all iterations so he keeps iterating all the rows i don't want to run it so this is how you export or import once import is done what you will do is you will import back the data that initially we have used because once you have done your job after that you import back the original sheet and then put it back into this is how you finally finish so that base state you are maintaining the base state for that run so you import a data retrieve the data and then export it back or ignore it and take the import back the original data sheet so this is also the way you can manage your sheet data very easy very simple very effective that is why he has provided data table object much easier than